super excited to start my YouTube channel. What I'm gonna do is I'm gonna go over each choreographed song slowly, teach it to you guys, do a little tutorial, and then once I, y'all kind of grasp it, learn it, then we'll do it with the music. So this one's called a hula hoop, and this is the first song for the first mix. So I have two classes. Basically what I do is I start up with three more songs, then like eight to nine core songs, then I'll do one stretch song, and then one dance party at the end where we usually dance in a circle, but since this is gonna be online tutorial, you can just party in your living room by yourself. But, um, or with your family. Um, so I won't go over the warm up songs just because they are pretty self explanatory. There's not very any complicated movements to it, but I will go over each of the core songs individually. So between my first and second class, a lot of the songs on the second class repeat themselves, but some of them don't. So I'll start off with the first class. And then I think there's like three new songs, new choreographed songs in the second class that I'll teach at the end of this. So the first one's called Hula Hoop and we'll just go through it slowly. I'll do it facing you guys and then I'll face the back. So you start off with um, holding the first four eight counts. Then maybe it's two eight counts, I don't remember exactly, but I'll count you off five, six, seven, eight when we do it with the music. And a lot of times you'll see me put my hand up like this. Five. You won't be able to hear me, but you'll hear, see my hand pulls. And on the eight, then go into it on one. So the first eight count is just your hip to your right. And a lot of my movements start with the right. Occasionally we'll start with the left. So you're gonna go one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, switch it to the left. A one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, go back to the right. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, back to the left. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. From there, you're just going to slide and shimmy, slide and shimmy. Then you take it back, stepping with your right foot. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. Then again, slide and shimmy, slide and shimmy. Take it back. Five, six, seven, eight. So since a lot of us are probably doing this in our living room, make as much room as you can. Um, usually I would do like big steps and big movements, but we're just gonna work with what we got. It's sort of a small space. So a lot of them, I might just be kind of like holding in place or just doing small steps instead of big, bigger ones. So from the other side, one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, and one. Switch it right. Switch it left. Five, six, seven, eight, and slide and shimmy. Slide and shimmy. Take it back. And slide and shimmy. And slide. So this is dance fitness, so a lot of the movements are repetitive, right? We're not wanting like a complicated choreographed song from the beginning to the end. So after you did hips, slide and shimmy, you just walk forward and eight count, sass. So the more you cross a, like over your front foot, the more dramatic and sassy it is. So one, two, three, Four, keep walking five six seven eight then you're gonna bring it back one two three four five six seven eight so it's just like this like party in with your arms and then you're just like kicking it back so it's just one two three four five six seven eight kick it back two three four five six eight so you do that twice forward and backward forward and backwards then from there you're gonna face the right you step out and pop it, okay? So, okay. And then you turn to the other side. Step out, so it's here. So it's the broken T, but it's diagonal. So, pop, pop. So one, two, three, four, pop. And you do that basically back and forth for about four, eight counts, so it's a while. And remember, this is dance fitness. This would be a good cardio workout, so you should be out of breath. So from the back, you just did walking forward. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. Take it back. Walk it forward. Take it back. Then step out. So 
again, facing your right, step out. One, two, bring it in. Three, four, one, two, three. Okay? Then after that, you just repeat it again. So this is a long song. I want to say it's like a four minute song. So basically, we'll do that choreography. We'll repeat it. We'll go right into the repeat. We'll have a break in between, like maybe four eight count break. And then we'll go into the second to the choreography that we repeat twice. So I'll teach you that part too. So this is gonna be some floor work. So you go down to the ground. This is like a little sexy, fun stuff. So you're gonna walk forward one and you're gonna pop your back. Okay, so basically you're gonna walk forward on your hands and knees, two eight counts, forward, two eight counts back. You're gonna hold it in place for three eight counts, and then you're gonna twerk it up for one eight count. So I'll go over here. So you pop one, two, pop, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, and one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, okay. So if I had more room, I would be really big with it, but we'll make do. So we just went forward an eight count, then we're gonna go back. So it's one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, and one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. So if you did two eight counts, two eight counts, you hold it in place, and it's kind of like you're just rolling in a circle. So starting towards the back, rolling towards the front leg. It's almost uh, like yoga, so cat, well, I don't know the terms, but I won't even try to go there. We just roll it. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. Last one, three, five, six, seven, eight. One, two, three, four, twerk it, five, six, seven, close it eight. So you just repeat again. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. And if you need to, like if your knees hurt, you need knee pads, go ahead and wear knee pads. If that doesn't work, you just want to stand and you don't want to do any floor work, you're welcome to do that too. So what you can do, one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, and one. So you can just do it in place. And then you can go around and come up instead of doing the whole hands and knees. So two eight counts, four, two eight counts back. You hold three eight counts, one, two, Three, four, twerk it five, six, seven, close eight. And this is really easy. So you just step out and you do it for four eight counts. Pop, pop. Okay? Come on. Pop, pop. Pop, pop. So it's one, two, three, and four, five, six, seven, and eight. So it's just pop, throw. Step back, pop, throw. Okay, so if you do that for four eight counts, then you Throw it around and bring it back. So it's just step out right, step out left, step out right, step out left. So your right foot goes out, your right arm comes across your body. So one and two, three and four, five and six, seven and eight. So we'll do it facing the other way. One, two, three, four, six, seven, eight. One, two, three, four. This is the floor work. Five, six, seven, eight. Take it back. Two eight counts. Hold it, roll it around. Three eight counts. One, two, three, four, twist it up, five, six, seven, close eight. One, two, three, and four. Five, six, seven, eight. One, two, three, four. It's just like you basically just step out, lean, and it's all in your chest. After that, the arm around. So, two, three, and four. Eight. After that, you basically do opposite. You throw it out, down, and then you torque it down. And then we're gonna repeat, repeat the floor work. Same thing. Two eight count forward. Two eight counts back. Hold it for two eight counts instead of three. Work it up, and then that's the end. So yeah, let's do it with some music.
Now, cool. Yeah. 